Hey, good afternoon. It is October 27th, 2023. I'm going to be taking out this 1995 Mercedes-Benz E320 Cabriolet. Uh, the car is finished in midnight blue, 904 over parchment leather. Uh, it's a one-owner car from new. Purchased this car from the original owner here in New Jersey. The car was purchased at Contemporary Motor Cars in Little Silver, New Jersey. Uh, purchased in 95. Um, the price in 1995 for this vehicle was 79,595 miles. The car presently has 44,398 miles. You can see the seat belt presenters both function flawlessly. Very uncommon to find them still in working order after all these years. Parts are no longer available and uh, it's nice to see a one owner car with 44,000 miles in this condition and in this color combination. This is absolutely my favorite color combination for the A124. This is the final year of that car. Um, 95 is the final year that they made these cars. Condition wise, cosmetically, you're going to be hard pressed to find a nicer one. Uh, Burlwood is in beautiful condition. You can see the, uh, the gauge needles are bright orange. The interior leather is beautiful. The carpet is very clean. This was a weekend toy car for the, uh, the one and only owner who purchased the car new. And uh, the car was always kept under a cover in the garage. And uh, mechanically, it runs and drives beautiful. I mean, very, very tight. The steering is nice and tight. The suspension is excellent. Uh, work that we're, we've done in preparation for the sale is we did a full tune-up. Uh, we replaced all of the soft top hydraulics proactively. Uh, the soft top was in working order and two of the hydraulics were previously replaced. But... Um, we went ahead and replaced all of them, including the ones that were replacement parts. Um, we just weren't sure where they came from or how old they were, so we proactively changed all the hydraulics for the soft top. Uh, the front engine seal was redone. It does have uh, a Delphi upper wiring harness. And I'll show that in my photos. All power options function as intended. The AC is ice cold. Uh, when I got this car uh, a number of weeks ago, it was still warm out, so we had to use the AC a little bit. And the AC blows nice and ice cold. Stereo works great. Power seats work perfectly, so do the heated seats. You can see how it drives. I mean, very smooth driving car. That's what these cars are known for. This is a car that I consider one of the top modern classics. This is a car that represents uh, an era at Mercedes-Benz where they were always at the forefront of uh, drive quality, reliability, comfort, safety. Uh, most of all, the styling. I mean, this is a true... Santo Error Mercedes-Benz styled car. Uh, very, very angular. It's a square body car. Uh, what I like most about it is it's it's a usable uh, modern classic where you know you can daily drive this car. It has a good sized back seat. It's got plenty of uh, protection built in with the pop-up uh, headrests in the rear. Two airbags up front. And uh, can't wait to shoot my walk around video. You'll see the condition of the car. It's really in exceptional condition. Uh, when we 
got the car, the first thing we did was we brought the car to Lee's Garage in uh, Shrewsbury, New Jersey. At one point in this car's life, um, when the hydraulics gave the owner a problem, they didn't realize that when they were operating the roof, hydraulic fluid spilled out onto the, uh, the trunk and it sat on the trunk and it created some staining on the trunk. So I brought the car to Lee's garage. The damage to the paint was extensive enough where it could not be removed by compounding. Uh, the hydraulic fluid ate into the clear coat. We tried wet sanding and buffing it and it just wasn't working. So uh, I had the trunk of the car repainted. Also had the rear bumper refinished. It had a, had a few nicks and scratches in it. Then we brought the car back to the shop, uh, had a full paint correction done on it, and that's when I noticed that the front bumper had some defects in the paint also that just, I mean, the, the car looked so great and the, uh, the front bumper was just not perfect. So I removed the front bumper, brought it over to Lee's. I had that refinished a week ago. So now front rear bumpers and the trunk were just refinished. The paint match is dead on them car looks exceptional uh, all original glass glass is beautiful no acid rain etching no scratches beautiful running and driving car and uh, this color combination the midnight blue is in my opinion the absolute best color for this car this is my third Midnight Blue A124 that I've owned in the last five years, and uh, I fell in love with all three of them. I mean, it's it's just an absolutely stunning color combination. Works really well on this body style. So uh, this car will be coming up for auction on Bring a Trailer. Um, it will be a no reserve auction. So I made sure to get this drive video shot today. I'm going to try to do the walk around video over the weekend and uh, show the, the cosmetic condition of this car, which is really, really spectacular. And um, this way it gives a prospective bidder the chance if they see the video or they see the photos on Instagram of the car and are interested in bidding on this car, they're more than welcome to come out and inspect it prior to the auction or have a third party uh, come out and inspect it on their behalf. We've got a nice straightaway here. Once I get a break in this traffic, I'll show you how it accelerates. Straight stick, straight six engine, silky shift smooth, uh, silky smooth shifts. I apologize, it's been a long day. I'm working on a couple other cars all day. Uh, as I mentioned, the soft top works perfectly. Um, overall, the condition of this car is really pristine. I will show in my walk around video any minor cosmetic defects. Like I mentioned, mechanically, she's ready to go. Had a full tune-up. Um, all the fluids and filters have been refreshed. It's got brand new, um, I can't even remember the make of tires. I believe they're Continental, brand new Continental tires. In fact, this is the first time the car has been driven on these tires. And uh, we had the wheels uh, professionally refinished and powder coated. They have the aluminum brushed um, outer face with the paint on the inserts. They were done correctly. I had them done by uh, Dayton Wheel in Asbury Park, New Jersey. They did an absolutely spectacular job of finishing these wheels. Um, brakes are excellent. It's just a, just a really nice one owner car. Clock keeps perfect time. Stereo sounds great. It has the original soft top. The soft top I would describe as in very, very good condition. It does have some minor wear, which we will point out. And 
we wrestled with the fact that, you know, the car being in such pristine condition, do we leave the original soft top or do we uh, replace it? Well, I, I opted to keep the original soft top in place, but this car will come with a brand new uh, navy blue soft top in the event the new owner wants to upgrade the soft top in the future. So, uh, this car will be coming up for auction on Bring a Trailer. It will be a no reserve auction. The high bidder gets the car in seven days. So, uh, probably be a couple of weeks before it goes live. So, if you see this video and you're interested in this car, you want to have it inspected, uh, just reach out to me and we'll make that happen. Um, today's October 27th, 2023. Uh, 1995 E320 Cabriolet, one owner, 44,403 miles, uh, coming up for auction soon on Bring a Trailer. Just want to wish everyone the best luck. Have a great weekend.